<laughs> hey y'all, it's Trey. Good to see you again. Can you guys believe that we are already fully into spring? This year, 2023, seems like it is going by pretty quickly and I am okay with that for now. I just had a really great birthday, work is picking up, um, and I take busyness as a good thing because more busyness means more money and your boy has rent due and bills to pay. It's all good stuff. That's how I feel right now. Maybe that's the magic of spring. <laughs> but that's just the zone I am in and I'm very grateful for it because I have some ruts I go through sometimes. Today's video is a reaction to a request from my patron Emily over on Patreon. You guys know I have been loving me some Whitney Houston lately, um, as well as So Yang. And this is going to be a performance from So Yang singing a Whitney Houston song. So, we have two great voices that are a part of this masterpiece I'm about to experience, all right? <laughs> this is going to be So Yang performing I Have Nothing at the 2015 DMC Festival. Buckle up, you guys. It's gonna be a good, good time. And without further ado, let's dive right into this reaction video. Oh. She's taking her time, okay? She scooped up into that share. Share my life. She's really taking her time breaking up the phrases, all right? It's, 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 as an audience, it makes you, I think, pay a little bit more attention when they're, uh, she's making her own phrasing, you know? She's, she's treating this very differently. Take my love, I'll never That take my love, just slightly different, slightly different. I don't think that's how Whitney does it, on the recording at least. Take my love, take my love. I yeah. never ask for too much. She said, take it up. <laughs> also, is this in a higher key than the Whitney recording? I'll never ask. I'll never ask. I'll never ask for too much. Okay, maybe they're in the same key. I'm trying to figure this out. So Yen just has a very, very um, bright, bright sound. Um, and I think the arrangement is also in a little bit of a different place. I think they're the same key, but what is So Yang doing? I think she just has a brighter voice that's making it sound like it's more, um, it's ma it makes it sound like it's higher, but I think it's her brighter energy that she brings. To stop at you are and everything that you do Ooh. 
to study that build again. She did what? Excuse me. If I don't, oh, you. And a beautiful finish to straight tone, and then just at the very end, the vibrato. Ah. Oh. Gorgeous, but also, what the heck? What, what in the world? She really has a, a voice from another planet, okay? Because what was that? Don't make me close one more door. You guys, I have seen a lot of performances of I Have Nothing, okay? Um. I've, of course, I've seen Whitney Houston perform it. I have seen the video of Jesse J performing it at the singer competition um, in China. And now I've seen So Yang sing it. I've never seen someone do that bill, that Don't make me close one more door. I've never seen someone do that and dare to go that high. For that part of the song, people people will add their own high notes, you know, like in, in the, they'll add a run here, you know, or they'll, they'll do something shorter later. But at that point in the song where you are needing to use all of your air to hold out those notes and really give this super dramatic build to your audience, all the other singers are like using all of their energy to hold those notes. And So Yang's like, mm, I still have a little bit of gas left in the tank. So we're going to go up one more. 
oh my goodness. And then those, those long, long notes that she holds out and then uses the very last of her air to bring you in, you know? She fills the space and then she makes you focus in on these little, 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 little notes that she does at the very end, just to be very, very tender. Oh, she plays with us and I love it. <laughs> I tell you, my very favorite performers are the ones who aren't just telling a story, um, aren't just looking good for the camera, you know, aren't just getting all of the notes right and being very technical and showing off some skills. The very, very best ones I love are the ones that do all of that and also connect with the audience in a way that is so memorable and so touching beyond just, whoa, she did that high note. It's it really pulls you in and makes you pay attention. The power of the voice. So Yang is someone who understands the power of the voice to really, really touch people. Oh my goodness. I've never seen that song performed that way. And I probably never will see someone else perform it that way again because that is so uniquely So Yang. Man, Emily, you really know how to pick them. You really know how to pick them. That just left me smiling from ear to ear. So Yang. This is the vibe. This is the vibe. I'm glad I'm getting me some more So Yang in my life because I, I've been missing out on this, you know? I really have. Um, but never too late to uh, discover an amazing, amazing artist like her. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know what you thought in the comment section down below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Send me more stuff to react to, and I will see y'all again very, very soon. Bye!